black and right away I smell that the sea odor clings to everything so funky and nasty. Everything having to do with the mentally handicapped the politically correct will call me a bigot. But I bet they're fat these days. Never been subjected to such a smell in all there and I know where I'm at. There is a bed sits in the center of the floor, and reclining pulled up to his chin, is our boy. He has a bad blonde cut, and a heavy jaw, and his clothes. He mumbles something in a hollow, weird voice that I can't quite make out. But he is smiling. He knows we're powerless to do anything to move him, and he looks pretty comfortable, if not entirely clean. I don't know what to say. I put my hands on my hips. Then I realize something funny. The bed he is resting on is made of those same damnable and looks pretty damn uncomfortable. I can't hear it groan and creak and crush under his weight as he turns over. He peeps an eye at us mischievously, and then screws both lids shut again, as if he is trying hard to get back to whatever dismal little dream he was having before we so rudely interrupted. I think maybe he is dreaming about how much fun he is having getting over on the system. Asterisk 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 the system system likes me, so it was with an amount of aplomb that I was chosen to meet the president, who was an amiable old B movie actor that played chimpanzees. This was long ago, and the man has passed on to greener pastures. But I got to go to the White House screening room, where a famous director with connection to the CIA show. As I sat there amid the rows of suits and the high, floating stink of actor shape, I realized that it was because, for some reason, they had changed the ending. Now, about halfway through, it became an entirely different movie. Now, instead of a bicycle ride in the sky, accompanied by Squad 3 alien in a basket, the kids were flying Black Hawk helicopters. Maybe the president liked this version of events better. And calling each other funny nicknames over the radio. Names that had to do with different varieties of fruit, I think. I can't remember specifically. I wondered where in the hell those kids learn these helicopters. And we never did get to see the alien. I so badly wanted to see the alien. But we just saw a bunch of flying over canyons. And I started to fall asleep. And the president was standing there nudging me, calling me little fella. And the famous director who was a Jewish guy with a beard and a baseball cap was standing there beaming with kindly eyes. But the president looked a little scary. He had a bad shape. I can't remember. He had a cruel, inscrutable face, face of a robot, the mechanical sort of smile that said, Don't he come to me with your petty concerns and trivialities? Blow up the world twenty times if I wanted to. You think I am your outmoded politics? I am not interested at all. Don't he held up a hand. He had four fingers. Was missing a thumb. Men in suits with black sunglasses changed positions. Outside, Washington slept the sleep of the rest.